exactly a year after I published my first preview into Peace, the first artwork in this new series, I now have my second one titled Gentleness. A lot of different factors led me to wanting to do a series based around the fruits of the spirit. Even though I don't usually do spiritual based artworks because it's important to me that my art be accessible to everyone and have multiple layers of meaning that people can come to with their own thoughts, emotions, and experiences to get something out of. I really want my art to resonate with everyone. That's something that's very important to me. And also important is that it can be interpreted differently by different people. However, the more I thought and ruminated on the fruits of the spirit and their meanings, I realized that these really are for everyone. Despite what your faith background might be, where you are right now, what you're feeling, your own personal experiences, take peace and now gentleness. These are things that are beneficial for all of us to cultivate in our own lives. One thread of common symbolism that runs through all of these pieces is birds, a different one for each piece. And for gentleness, I specifically chose to include house sparrows because they are widely considered pests, especially in this area. How often might we also view the other people around us in this same way? We don't know everyone else's story and why they are the way they are. And I see us becoming a lot better at approaching children that are experiencing maybe some behavioral issues or difficulty socializing with others due to disabilities, mental health issues, or trauma. But what we forget is that children with disabilities, mental health issues, or trauma grow into adults with disabilities, mental health issues, or trauma. And we're not so great all the time at accepting or approaching with love and again gentleness those same issues in adults. I included the symbol of the woman holding the egg with the world map printed on it for a very deliberate reason. I believe that our world and our society can be very fragile and I truly believe that gentleness can help heal it. Gentleness is really just love paired with wisdom. It doesn't mean you're a doormat. It doesn't mean that you allow yourself or others to be mistreated. I will be doing a small video on each of my pieces in this series. I've already started the next one. And this time around, I don't think it will take an entire year for me to give you a preview of the finished product. So if you want to see more, please be sure to subscribe. Thank you.